Hi there, Richard Matthew here. So if you're in network marketing and you require a Black Friday sale or any type of sale, then you suck at marketing, right? You're just not doing it right. Let me explain how you will never need a sale again if you do certain things can always get above and beyond the right reach and attention the right team members and sales. Um, let's just dive into this. I think it's a really important topic. So when was the last time that you saw Rolex or Bentley or Ferrari have a Black Friday or any type of sale ever? I mean, if you did, there's something wrong in that business, right? Why, why would there be something wrong? Because they don't need to. Because they have two things with their products, and that is value and results. You go and buy a Bentley, right? And what do you get? You get the result of getting that car with the feeling and the performance and the build quality that you knew you were gonna get. And also when you pay that money, you're happy with the value exchange. You're willing to invest the money to get the car in return. It's a good deal for everybody, the company and you. So unless there's some kind of like end of the line product being discontinued or something like that in your MLM, which again, if you have more supply than demand, you're not really doing it right. You should never need this type of sale to kind of give a, a, a kind of push to your sales. You should be offering value and you should be offering results, which means that your potential target audience is more than happy to buy any time of year. They don't just come rushing for you with a handout looking for a cheap offer. Let's look at how we can do this. So you can't control your company's products, can you? Your company gives you a product, it gives you the RRP, and that's pretty much it. But here's some things that you can do that can look at value and results. You can look at a bonus package. Okay, and this bonus package can be something unique to you and you can put this together with nothing but a little bit of time and effort. It's not going to cost you any money. So why would you not want to do this? So many network marketers don't. So let me give you some examples of this. Let's say you are in a beauty company, right? And you sell a particular package of products. Maybe you don't, maybe you sell individual products, but it'd be great if you could get a package of products together and sell some more. So maybe you put a particular three or four package of products together, three times these products, you're now making more sales. But then in order to entice that, you create a guide to use these products the best. Here's why I recommend these three products, and here's what they're gonna do for you, and here's why when they work together, they're far more powerful than just trying them separately on their own. It's a great, better deal, and this is the benefit and results you're gonna get. You could give away some kind of guide, right? Could you not also partner with somebody? Maybe if you are not a fitness professional yourself, but you're selling maybe diet pills, something like that, could you not partner with a qualified nutritionist or a qualified trainer so you know you're above board all the legalities, right? And you could give them a free consultation with that person you partnered with. Then you go to this nutritionist and you say, listen, I don't know if anyone will buy from you or not, but why don't you give them some value and help them with a basic nutritional guide and then offer them your services if they want to pay for that and get a bigger package. Now that's appointments in the diary for the nutritionist for 20 minute consultations and it's extra value for you to offer with your products. There's many different ways that you could do this, but can you imagine the position you would occupy when you've done this? You've got the stock product, stock product, no additional value, no additional results. It has to be discounted. It has to be to, to, to try and give people an advantage in the marketplace. But we have you over here. The product is just the beginning. It's just the first step. We have a guide. We have better results. We have these partnerships. It's all equating to value. The customer walks away saying, I got a great deal. The customer goes to everybody they know without you even telling them, says, you should see this guide and this value and this bonus package that this person's got. I mean, the product is, okay, the product is a little bit expensive, but overall, look at the package that you get. It's definitely a great deal. Now, you'll never have to discount again. You'll never have to go with your cap out saying, please, will you buy my product? You'll never struggle with having a garage full of stuff so you have to discount it because your supply is too high and the demand's not there. Think about it. You know that it makes sense. And I, and I practice what I preach. I never, ever, ever discount my products. You know, the only time there is some kind of reduced price on what I do, it's at the launch. Why? Because I want to reward the people that follow me. If you watch my YouTube videos, if you're on my email list, if you're you know a subscriber of mine, a podcast follower, well, you, I want to give you the best deal. 
because you deserve it because you, you've been loyal to me I, I just think that makes sense so the only the lowest the price the product will ever be is when you see it <laughs> the lowest it will ever be of anything of mine is when you see it first because all that happens after the launch is the price goes up to what is still a great deal but I'm, I'm being unfair to myself here I'm like this is usually at break even or a small profit and then over here now I've got to get back to typical business and still give a great deal but I have to make some profit from this okay so that's the cheapest it'll ever be you'll never see me giving you a slap in the face and three months later say no you know that product you paid for oh, it's half price I don't I don't want to disrespect your loyalty like that and your hard-earned money so I never do discounts I never do things like that why because I make sure that my products get results and they offer a ton of value I, I like very, very, very rare. I can't remember the last time I got a refund on a product because pe I believe people are good. I believe they're trustworthy. And I believe even though I give money back guarantees, I know that when someone gets in there, they're not just going to rip me off and steal from me. They're going to look at the product and go, this is a great deal. Fair is fair. This is a fantastic product. And they're going to stick with the promise that we made together. I offer the value. They pay the money and everybody's happy. They don't ever come back asking for discounts or refunds or that type of thing because I focused on value and I focus on their results. It's a major thing you can do in your business and I hope that you implement it today. So as always, go create a day in a life that counts. Always have more desires and excuses. So did this help you? I hope that it did. And if you'd like more trading from me, of course, you can subscribe. If you want something specific, my most powerful detailed training and the best results is at richardmathrew.com forward slash webinar. It's a free webinar as you would expect from that link. Only for you if you want to go full time as a network marketer. So, you know, at least four figures a month and then beyond scaling from there. I'll catch you on the next training. If you're a subscriber, whatever you do, have a fantastic day uh, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.